Hey, what's up everybody? Commander Radix here, bringing you another episode of Transformers Lore. Right now, I'm trying to cover a lot of the spotlights that take place in the IDW universe that I kinda skipped over in my mad dash to cover the main stories of the Furman era IDW universe. Today, we're gonna be covering the story as told in Transformers Spotlight Nightbeat. The IDW Hasbro Universe, 2006. Nightbeat is an Autobot detective obsessed with solving mysteries. One of the mysteries that have never been solved is the question of what happened to the Ark-1. You see, six million years ago, Cybertron was in the midst of a golden age under the leadership of Nova Prime in his inner circle, such as the great scientist Geaxis. They boarded a ship that would be the first ship known as an Ark, and launched with the official mission being to find a safe passage between Cybertron and the Benzuli Expanse to expand the Cybertronian Empire. However, at some point, the Ark-1 disappeared with the crew becoming known as Legends and Heroes. However, Nightbeat has made contact with a mercenary, adventurer, explorer, and trader in outlawed materials known as Kraken from the planet Hyperion. Kraken is offering Nightbeat a flight recorder of the Ark-1 he found on the planet Gorlam Prime. Intrigued, Nightbeat went to meet with Kraken, but instead finds him dying. It seems like every part of him died at once, and the life was sucked out of him. Nightbeat begins his investigation and discovers that the flight recorder is missing. Nightbeat decides to take to heart Kraken's last words, that there was a hole in the world, before leaving for Gorlam Prime for answers. Gorlam Prime is an interesting world, as it is seemingly similar to Earth, populated by organic people who began their industrial maturity around 700 years ago. However, the people of Gorlam Prime have created a technological society as the people there have been upgrading from organic to techno-organic. Nightbeat observes society from his vehicle mode, interested in Gorlam Prime, as their technological leap suggests an outside civilization is influencing their development. Nightbeat makes his way to excavation site number 4, where he finds Cybertronian technology that dates back to the Ark-1, as well as a massive hole in the ground. As Nightbeat descends down the hole, he remembers Kraken's last words. He also uploads a copy of his journal and investigation notes to his ship. Meanwhile, a force of smaller Transformers known as Micromasters watch Nightbeat from afar. As Nightbeat continues his journey, he finds a massive, strange pool of unknown energy that also appears to be some sort of dimensional hole. Suddenly, he notices the Micromasters surrounding him. He tries to ask the Micromaster some questions, but they do not reply while some figures emerge from the portal behind Nightbeat. Nightbeat, horrified by what he sees, begins an escape attempt. However, the Micromast follow the orders of their superiors, and eventually Nightbeat is cornered and apprehended. The mysterious figures say that they have been waiting for him, and have been expecting him. They capture Nightbeat and begin experimenting him, saying ominous things like that the expansion will begin soon. Finally, a robot revealed to be Geaxis himself places a cerebral implant into Nightbeat's head. The figures tell Nightbeat that when they're ready, they'll call Nightbeat and he'll know what to do. And then, all of Nightbeat's memories of the incident are wiped. Later, Nightbeat is cruising in the Durzon sector when he gets a call from Optimus Prime, ordering Nightbeat to meet up with Hot Rod and Hardhead on the Ark-32 and to go to Earth as he needs his help with the mysteries on Earth. Nightbeat acknowledges the order before he gets a bit of a headache that concerns Optimus Prime, but Nightbeat tells Prime not to worry about it. But Prime should worry about it, as Nightbeat has been programmed to kill Optimus when the time comes. As Nightbeat begins his journey to the Ark-32, he doesn't notice the console to the side that is displaying the journal and notes he had uploaded to his ship that he no longer remembers. And that's going to wrap up today's episode of Transformers Lore. Nightbeat will arrive on Earth in Transformers Escalation, so if you want to see the continuation of that story, go check out the video I've made on that story. I plan on covering a few spotlights I skipped over in my mad dash to cover the main Furman era Transformer stories, so expect new spotlights coming out shortly. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe for more nerdy content. Follow me on social media and consider supporting me on Patreon if you want to see this channel continue. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day, ladies and gentlemen. 
Huge thanks to our patrons, including this month's $10 plus patron, Josh Atkins. Check out the description for more patrons and more info about how you can receive a shout out here.